My name is Matt Dudzik. Uh, I sing and play guitar in the band and write the songs. Uh, Johnny K is our new bass player as of last year. And uh, the drummer is Matt Chaney. Yeah. I started Poison Boys back in 2014. Um, experience was kind of just me starting a band in Chicago and playing some shows. Uh, the One of the the guys, the main dude I started the band with was uh, my best buddy uh, through my teenage years named Mike Littman. Uh, he passed away the same year we started the band. So that was kind of rough. And then I had to decide whether or not to continue the band. I figured since we wrote a lot of cool songs together, people should still hear them. So we continued on with the band and I got uh, sort of a new lineup. It just kept going. And uh Put out a bunch of tour or put put out a bunch of records and went on a few tours and uh, next thing you know it's ten years later. Um, I say come through and let's have some fun. We're gonna play a lot of new songs we got and uh, it's gonna be a total blast. A lot of those cities we've been to before, um, like Malaga and Granada, we're really excited to come back and play for everybody there. It's way tighter this time and way more. Uh, explosive and it's gonna be a good time that was the seven inch title from uh 2016 and um we compiled a whole bunch of our different seven inches and demos and unreleased recordings from uh, our early years before our first album came out and uh, we just compiled them all and put them out on one lp and called it head for disaster the cover was um our old bass player uh from uh, a lot of those uh, recordings on that record his name was adam sheets his uh partner from years ago um his girlfriend drew up a really cool design for our uh tour poster from 2015 for east coast u.s tour and um the poster looked so cool we wanted to reuse it so when we put out the headed for disaster seven inch i had uh the guy who released it on no front teeth records He's also an, a graphic designer, so he changed the art from the tour poster to be like a limited edition cover for the 7-inch cover of the Header for Disaster 7-inch back in 2016. And we really liked it, so back then it was just plain black and white. And uh, so our current bass player, Johnny K, his girlfriend, Christine, went ahead and uh, drew in or uh, filled in the color, rather, uh, for the that that like limited seven inch cover and we just used it as the header for disaster lp art pretty cool she did a great job and we like it <laughs> hope well, you do too all my inspiration uh usually hard times <laughs> usually when something bad happens uh, i feel like writing a song about it or i'll just you know even if something good happens um we got a, a new single coming out relatively soon that's kind of about when something good happens um yeah, I mean, I don't know. I it just anything. I, there's all kinds of inspiration. When I go out for a walk in Chicago here in the city streets and um uh, kind of just look around and see the sights and the grittiness in some parts of the city, uh I get inspired and I start thinking of like lyrics just start popping in my head and then go home and write a little song sometimes. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't, you know. Oh, uh, that's uh, our bass player, Johnny K. <laughs> he likes getting up early. To eat a lot? Probably me. <laughs> oh, that's all of us. We're all kind of nervous, guys. Joker, me, I, I got a problem with it. I, I never stop making jokes about everything and anything all the time. I guess it's just my way of kind of like uh, dealing with the nervousness and awkwardness. Elegant? Me or Matt Cheney, our drummer, probably. None of us. <laughs> it depends. Uh, it takes me like so long to make a post because I'm just terrible at social media. We all kind of are in this band. So um, it takes me a while, but I don't know. Hours. Are you talking about per day? If it's per day, then I don't know. One, I try to limit it. I compile the songs that I've written as to which ones are the strongest and which ones fit best in the best line you know like uh oh this one would fit really good in the beginning and then this is a good like kind of middle of the album song because i don't want it to be too boring for people in the beginning to jump into 
real long, slow one or something, you know? So, and then if there's a real high energy, like big chorus song, I usually stick it a little closer to the beginning, but it just depends how many of those are in the album. You know, we went to film part of our uh, video from last year called uh, Knock Down Again. And uh, our buddy Sleepy Doc Julius was filming it. And uh, we were looking for the right spot. We were just looking for an off-road location off the highway where we could just set up everything. But uh, it turned out to be extremely windy that day. So as we were playing and he was filming, and he was filming on real film, so it wasn't digital film. So we had very limited time to be filming with uh, uh, his actual film. And um, yeah, as we kept doing it, the wind kept knocking over the cymbals and just blowing our hair and stuff all in our face. So it just kind of made for some poor shots. But then we ended up getting enough to where we could compile it to make a decent video and decent as far as we think. So <laughs> that became the video. Well, we got to play at one of my venues I always wanted to play. It's called House of Blues in Chicago. We got to play there a few years ago in 2020, opening for the uh, UK punk band, The Addicts. Um, that was like a dream come true, definitely. That was like really amazing. We played to like 600 people or something for that show. And um, I don't know, a dream come true was definitely playing Spain. Spain rules. And we always wanted to do that because we knew we've heard Everybody that's ever played there said it's such a rock and roll country and that everybody there really loves our style. And uh, they weren't wrong because when we went there last year, it was pretty amazing. Everybody came out and it's a really good time. But uh, still to come, we hope to play Europe, maybe this year, the rest of Europe outside of Spain, as far as Western Europe. That would be a real dream come true. And getting our third album out, our third album is going to be dream come true as well. Right now we have um, a split LP with this band from Canada, uh, this power pop band from Montreal called Jonesy. We have a split LP with them coming out soon on Madrid's Ghost Highway Records. And uh, that should be out in a few weeks. And then um, uh, we're going to drop a single from that real soon. And uh, that's also going to include our song Knock Down Again, which has the video that I mentioned before. Uh, also... The next album will be coming out. Yeah. Well, my name is Matt Dudzik, and I'm in the band Poison Boys. Uh, wow, meow, imas. Adios. <laughs>